welcome back to my channel. My name's Ava, if you're new here. Hello. So today I am gonna talk about my very first day wearing my brace. So I've actually gotten a few comments asking me to talk about this. So here I am talking about it. So oh, let me tell you, the first day was probably the worst day. So when I saw my brace for the first time, it was really daunting and scary. It was this foreign thing that was gonna be put on me forever. Well, not forever, but in my mind, that's what I thought because I was just so overwhelmed. I tried it on and it didn't really fit well. And I was like, oh, this is gonna be the end. I'm gonna suffer my whole life, no! But I told them about what was wrong, like what didn't feel right. So they adjusted it for me and I felt better. So I started feeling a little better about myself. When I got home that day, I was told to wear it like a few hours, but I, I really couldn't. So don't push yourself too hard. You should always push yourself a little, but not too hard. I tried to wear it to sleep. It did not work because I thought if I could fall asleep with it, then I could like just take off a few hours, but it didn't work. So also when I got home, I put on my brace and then I tried on a bunch of clothing and there's a lot of clothing that did not fit because of my brace. And when I tell you, I was really devastated. I was so sad that my favorite shirt didn't fit and my favorite pants just looked weird, but it's okay because your brace is to benefit you. So then maybe in the future you can wear those clothes without having a bad back. So I didn't necessarily throw them away, but I did put them to the side. I took them out of my closet. And then when I did find the clothes that did fit, there's this one part on the back that just stuck out. And I hated that. I was so sad. I thought I was gonna be that girl with the back brace. But in the end, it really doesn't matter. Nobody cares. I went to school the next day and I wore it for about an hour and a half. And then I had to take it off because I just couldn't wear it. I had to carry it around with me around school. And people did give me stares like, what was this thing I was holding? And nobody was like making fun of me. Nobody cared. They're just, they're just intrigued. They're curious. So a couple people asked me what it was. And I was like, oh, it's a back brace. I have scoliosis. And they're like, okay. Nobody really cares. And if somebody does cares and makes fun of you, they're not worth it. They're not worth your time. You should just walk away and say, hey, that wasn't nice. I don't appreciate that. Trust me, that may sound a little like cringy or weird, but you know, they don't expect it. If someone is making fun of you for something that you're trying to actively fix, you should not listen to them because they might diminish your confidence and make you not want to keep going when in reality you should. You should stick with people who tell you that you can do this and that it's not a big deal because it isn't. But remember when I was talking about this little thing on the back that was sticking out from my brace and I thought everybody was gonna notice? Well, nobody noticed. I don't think anybody even looked in that direction. The only reason people asked nicely was because I was holding it. So the second day after school, even though I only wore it for about an hour and a half, my back was so sore. So I took the best bath ever and it relaxed my muscles. And then I put my brace on and I think I actually started dozing off in it, which is like so great that I couldn't sleep in it, which is such a shame, but it's okay. It takes time. After that, I figured out a few different styles with my brace. I found some really cute clothes to wear. And in the end, it was it worked out. My spine feels much better and it was really worth it. And now, since I've been wearing the brace for a really long time, I can now wear the clothes that I put aside because I couldn't wear them with my brace, I can now wear them, which I believe is the 
biggest milestone ever. When I put the clothes away on my very first day of wearing my brace, it was almost like a goal to reach. It was a goal to get myself to wear those clothes again. So I am so proud of myself that I reached that goal. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any suggestions or questions, let me know down in the comments below. And be sure to like, subscribe, and share this video so it can reach so many other people. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!